So what is an ore? Most metals combine readily with oxygen in the air to form impure compounds known as ores. We already know from previous lessons that copper and above in the reactivity series can react with oxygen to form a metal oxide. This is a metal which is directly combined with oxygen which is known as an ore. Extraction methods have to be used to separate the metal from the oxygen in the metal oxide. There are three different techniques to extract the metal. The first one is electrolysis, the second heating with carbon or carbon monoxide and the third is using heat alone. Metals which are higher in the reactivity series between aluminium to potassium bond more tightly to the oxygen and therefore need more energy to separate them. The technique that we would use to separate out this metal from the metal oxide is known as electrolysis. Electro meaning using electricity and lysis means to split up. So how does electrolysis actually work? We already know that the metal oxide breaks up to form the metal atom and oxygen gas. To do this, we have to dissolve the metal oxide, in this case potassium oxide, and dissolve it in water to form an ionic solution. We then set up a circuit using a battery, uh, some leads and some carbon electrodes. The positive ion is going to be attracted to the negative electrodes and the chemical equation that's happening there is known as a reduction. What we will see in the experiment is a solid precipitate being formed. That means that the oxygen ion, which is negatively charged, is going to be attracted to the positive electrodes. What we will see there is bubbles of gas being produced and the name of that chemical process is oxidation. The little story that I remember to remember the different types of extractions of metals is acute zebra can't macarena. Aluminium and above in the reactivity series need electrolysis to split them up. Between copper and zinc we would be heating with carbon or carbon monoxide and below copper, mercury and below, we would be using heat alone. This past paper question is from the National 5 2015 written 9a. Aluminium can be extracted from naturally occurring metal compounds such as bauxite. State the term used to describe naturally occurring metal compounds such as bauxite. These are known as ores. This past paper question is from the National 5 2014 written 12c. Magnesium cannot be extracted from its ore in a blast furnace. Suggest a method that would be suitable for the extraction of magnesium from its ore. Remember, acute zebra can't macarena. Aluminium and above, we would need to use electrolysis. Magnesium is found above aluminium, so we would have to use that extraction method.